Kikosi cha wanajeshi wa Kenya kilichokuwa kikihudumu katika jeshi la umoja wa Afrika huko Sudan Kusini kimerejea nchini hii leo kwa amri ya Rais Uhuru Kenyatta. Kenya iliamua kuchukua uamuzi huo baada ya kiongozi wa kikosi hicho kusimamishwa kazi na katibu mkuu wa umoja wa mataifa Ban Ki-moon aliyesema kuwa alishindwa kudhibiti vita nchini humo kumekuwa na mapigano Sudan Kusini kwa zaidi ya miaka mitatu kati ya wanajeshi watiifu kwa Rais Salva Kiir na wale wanaomuunga mkono aliyekuwa makamu wake Riek Machar. And today we have started our withdrawal from South Sudan following the directive given by His Excellency the President and Commander-in-Chief of the Kenya Defense Forces last week. Uh, KDF has taken part in many peacekeeping operations from 1979 to date. Uh, to date we have taken part in peacekeeping operations in 40, 44 countries. In all these operations, Kenya Defense Forces have performed very well. They have performed with Vela, with Vela, Kalantri, and we have also given the, we have also paid the ultimate price in some of the missions. These missions are still continuing in many parts of the, of the world as it is today, and even within our region. We are committed in our peacekeeping operations as a credible and well trained force deeply rooted in professionalism. Today we are very happy to have our soldiers back and the total number of our soldiers who have come today are 100.